All right, you guys, in this video here, I'm gonna walk you through uh, how to sign up for a free Trillo account. And then I'm also gonna show you how to set up a basic board uh, for your ongoing to-do list, your today list, and uh, your completed list. So again, it's uh, once I started using this, my productivity skyrocketed. So uh, again, follow along with this, set up your free account, and I guarantee you get this thing going and you are going to be uh, productive as hell. So, uh, so you go to Trillo.com, so T-R-E-L-L-O.com. Uh, you're going to come over, click on sign up. Uh, you're going to put in your name, uh, email. I'm going to use my personal email since I'm already signed up um, with my company email. Password, go ahead and put in uh, whatever you want to do for your password. Create new account, and I'm not going to say not now because I really don't care about this account. Uh, okay, I need to confirm oh, my email address, and that probably should have popped in. Bam, confirm, and now we're good to go. Okay, so um, this is what it's going to look like when you first sign up for your free account. With your free account, you can get you can make unlimited boards. So I'm going to be again in future videos showing you guys how to set up other boards. But today we're going to be focusing on just doing uh, setting up your to do board. All right. So from here, um, you got your untitled boards. You got your welcome board. Let's just go straight over here to create new boards. You're going to click on that. Uh, go ahead and name your board. So we're going to name this our. Uh, to do list and you can choose a background you can choose a color whatever you want to do I'm then going to click create board now from there you're going to start adding lists so with this one here it's going to be really basic this is going to be uh, your to do's so your ongoing to do list I'm going to save it and then I'm going to create my next uh, list uh, which is going to be working on or your today list Oh, let's do that. Let's just name it today list. Bam. If I could spell. Save it. And then I'm going to work on completed. Okay. Um, so that's it. So um, you, can all, you can add more lists if you want to. Again, with this to-do list, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm showing you guys how to simply set this thing up. So let's start off with uh, the to-do list. So I'm going to add a card. So a card would be an, an item that you're adding to your to-do list. So let's say uh, film this film this video. Okay, I'm gonna add that one. Um, let's say uh, follow up with Joe. Um, let's do what else? Uh, set up a credit card processor. I'm just throwing shit out there. All right, so those are my to-dos. So let's say um, today, you know, again, these should be your ongoing to. There should be there could be hundreds of items on this ongoing to-do list. Okay, these are the these are when you, these are the items that you you know as they come in, you add them to this ongoing to-do list. So some stuff may sit on my to-do list for a year before I get to it because it's not. I want to eventually get to it, but it, it's not as as important to get to it as some of the other items. Uh, so let's say filming this video is super important. Um, so um, now I can, for each one of these cards, I can actually click on it and I can add more things. So let's say I want to add a checklist. So I want to add add a checklist um, and add an item. So uh, outline, okay? So it's going to create a checklist for you on all the items that you need to get done. Uh, so I'm just going to add a bunch of different things here. So you can set up a checklist inside this card. So, hey, I finished the outline. I finished this part. I finished this part. All good to go. Uh, you can add comments in here. Um, so the comment section is going to be more for shared uh, boards. So I'm going to show you guys all that when I get to the video on how to create your Trillo board for your assistant. Okay. So uh, you can create, uh, you can put labels on here different labels. So if it's, you know, something super important, then I could put a red label on it. Um, members, this is where you'd be like, let's say if I want to add my assistant to this, I can, I can add her as a member here and add her to it. 
um, due date, you put a due date on it, you can click attachments, you can get you can put attachments on it in case there's an image or something that goes with it, uh, different actions uh, that you can do. So there's, there's so much stuff you can do with this, but again, we're just, I'm just showing you how to scratch the surface here. So once we've created uh, all the items in our to-do list, let's say I'm gonna be working on filming this video for today. So all I'm gonna do is just click on it and drag it over to today. So whatever items I'm gonna actually be working on, um, you know, for today, for my today list, I'm gonna drag over to my today list. Okay, simple as that. Um, so throughout the day, you know, I'm gonna put, uh, let's say today's list, uh, coaching. So I do coaching calls almost every day. Uh, my, my daily workout, I'm gonna put that on here. So every single item, you know, shit, let's say, you know, I'm getting, I had to get my hair cut today. All that stuff is gonna be added. How about we add it? There we go. All that stuff's gonna be added to my to my ongoing, uh, my, my today list, the stuff I'm gonna get done today. And as the day goes through, I keep my board up, and then all I'm gonna do is just, as I complete these items, move it over to my completed section, and then at the end of the day, all I do is I come up here, I click on uh, the, the, the three dots up here, I go down to here, archive all cards in this list, and I erase all the, all the items that I completed for that day, and then I start the whole process again tomorrow, okay? So this is just another way you can set up uh, your to-do list. There's Again, I've given you other ways to do it. You've gotta figure out what's gonna work best for you, um, and this has actually, turned into my, my go-to uh, to-do list and today list just because I'm on Trillo all day long uh, going messaging back and forth with my assistant and other people on my team. So hopefully this was helpful to you. Again, future videos on Trillo stuff, we're going to be teaching you guys a little bit more on how you can utilize this program.